Sheriff David Clark and James O'Keefe at Freedom Summit 2018. Tickets on sale now at freedomsummitchicago.com. Top of the morning, Dan and Amy, and it's uh, football season. You get uh, the uh, Wheaton Mournville South kid breaking the state record for field goals with eight. Eight kicks. Yeah, eight, eight field, field goals. goals. Yeah, right. he's shot from 40. Shot. Kicked from 48 oh yards, 44, 24, and he broke a school record. That's huge. Yeah. Uh, it's state record. State record. Yeah, yeah that's good. Uh, you got Purdue and Northwestern tonight. Yeah. Kicking off Big Ten season. Then, is uh, that at? Where is it? Is that game at? It's, at, it's in Evanston. Yeah. Isn't it? No, it's no? in Lafayette. Oh, it's in West Lafayette? Yeah. Uh, whatever. Who cares? <laughs> It's your alma mater. You don't care, but I care about my Iowa Hawkeyes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they open up tomorrow, or not tomorrow, Saturday. Yeah, 2.30 at Iowa, and they play none other than Northern Illinois University. And you can hear the Huskies defeat the Hawkeyes starting at 2.30 on Saturday on these airwaves. And uh, for more of a preview of that game and another upset of the... Three yards in a cloud of dust, Iowa Hawkeyes offense. We're pleased to be joined by Sean Fraser, Associate VP and Director of Athletics at NIU. Sean, thanks for joining us. Appreciate it. Yeah, thank you very much, guys. How are you guys doing? Good. How are you? And I'm doing fantastic. All right. So what's going to happen on Saturday uh, when uh, NIU travels to play the Hawkeyes? You've got a, a Hawkeye here. you got a lot of Iowa alums in Chicago that are insufferable, and uh, right, I'd like to are. see Iowa defeated. <laughs> you know, I'm going to avoid that trap. I'm just going to say that uh, I've been listening to you, Amy. I, I, I got you. I, see, I, I hear the passion. Yeah. I'm good with that. I'm I've got a Herky that. the Hawkeye symbol in my hand right now as we're yeah. doing this. <laughs> so no, the boys are ready. We're fired up. You know, this was uh, my first away game when I came to NIU, and uh, we were fortunate to pull out a victory uh, in 2013. And, you know, it's going to be a battle when these two teams come together. You know, they're very physical. They're uh, historic. They got tradition-based. And uh, they're going to be well-coached. And uh, we have some great kids on both sides. So it's going to be one heck of a game. Tell us about your quarterback. Tell us about your team. Who are the stars Uh, and unsung heroes? (laughs) <laughs> well, they're all stars, and you, got, you have to understand that from my perspective. They're all stars. We have some folks, uh, you know, they've gotten some notoriety. Sutton Smith, our defensive end, uh, you know, he's uh, obviously an All-American, uh, and, uh, you know, he's done a great job uh, last year. But he'll be the first one to tell you that that happened uh, last year, and uh, he's got to prove himself this year. Uh, uh, Sharping, too, on our offensive line, you know, uh, plays tackle for us, uh, uh, a great human being, unbelievable off and on the field. He'll do a fantastic job as well. Again, you know, second team All-American. And, uh, you know, again, you know, those guys are symptomatic of what we do overall, offense, defense, special teams. Uh, all the young men on the team are well-prepared. They're passionate about NIU and NIU football. And uh, they're going to bring their A game on Saturday. There's no question. All right, you got Ryan Graham. He's a quarterback from Wheaton, Warrenville South. Let's talk about kids from Wheaton because that's what I care about. Uh, tell me about Ryan Graham. Ryan Graham's again. I, I, I've said it before. I'll say it again. You know, we've got kids that are passionate, really passionate about playing football and, and getting a great education. And Ryan, it, 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 he exemplifies that. So. He's going to contribute. He has contributed, and uh, we're excited. We're excited about our offense, and uh, quite frankly, we're we're excited about all phases of our game. All right, when are you uh, guys going to get back and get a rematch with Florida State in a BCS bowl game? Well, you know we we uh, well BCS is no longer. It's well, like you know what? Yeah, playoff, yeah, yeah, right. Then the playoffs. Yeah, I'm yeah. Not old school. Yeah, but, yeah. Yeah, you know, you know, we play Florida State this year. We're, we we go down uh, to Florida State, so we'll have a rematch of. Of Florida State, uh, yeah, obviously it's a regular season game. We're excited about that. We got a real tough schedule, and uh, you know that's going to be a war down there. There's no question about it. Oh, that's fun that's to get a Florida State guys. game, yeah, yeah that's in Tallahassee. That'll be fun. And then when you go to bigger schools yeah, that you play, then they give you some cash, right, at the door, so that you can uh, grow your program. <laughs> yeah. Or do we not talk yeah. about this? Yeah, yeah they hand out bags of cash yeah. when you show not- up to play Florida State. <laughs> Or when you go to Iowa, when you play bigger schools, it helps your program, correct? Yeah, you know, uh, those guarantee games, when they don't come to Husky Stadium, so a good example is that we've got Utah coming to 
our place this year. That's a home and home. We go back to them. So those are different financial arrangements. But when we have one-offs, like, you know, Iowa or Florida State, yeah, there's a compensation component to get a, a, a brand like NIU. So, uh, yeah, I don't know about bags of cash. I, mean, <laughs> I didn't that. mean that, but, I mean, <laughs> the Hawkeyes yeah. have to shell out some money because they, you know, yeah. share the profits at the door. Yeah. It's only yeah. fair. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I would agree. I like your logic, and, uh, yeah, we yeah we do that. Yes, absolutely. So, uh, <laughs> so Sean, uh, Amy Jacobson is the proud parent of uh, – a uh, high school freshman at Amundsen. It's Amundsen I don't know High School. It, I don't know. Nobody's ever heard of it. But anyway, he's a freshman in high school in Chicago, and he's like 6'10", 450 pounds. Um, he's starting on varsity as a freshman. Uh, I'm probably going to sign him to represent him. We may have him skip college and go right to the pros, but if he goes to college, you, you may want to get in on this action. Well, when you just said 6'10", 400 pounds, yeah, there's probably going to be a few people that's going to be uh, looking for his services. There's no question about that. No, he's got a size 15 Uh, shoe. He's not done growing. His proper measurements are 6'3 and a half, 200 pounds. But he's a freshman. Yeah. Yeah. He's still got room to grow. Yeah, that's a nice size. Yes. Yeah, that's a very nice size, and uh, that growth will definitely put him into a certain percentile of uh, recruitment. There's no question about that. I, I, I'm precluded to, to doing any of that recruitment from NCAA bylaws, but I will say this. Uh, I'm quite sure there will be interest. Yeah. Uh, and, and, well, do you recruit heavily from the Chicago area? Yeah. Oh, my God. You need to look at our roster. Yes, Excellent. we do. We, 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 um, we have significant amount of our Chicago land boys on the team. Um, we, we do very well in the state. We're represented big time. And uh, so we, we, when we wave the flag of the state flag, Illinois, we are the state flag. Right? And we are the state of Illinois. There's no question about that. At least uh, some Illinois university is keeping uh, local talent at home. Uh, now, just with respect to uh, 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 Amy's uh, son, the freshman. <laughs> I just, just kind of want to lay out some grounds. I, I'm not officially representing it, but I'm just saying in my perspective, and I'll confer with my client. Uh, and that is, that is, you know, we're not so hep to a lot of academic rigor. We really want to focus on football. We want the payday. Uh, all right, so we, this needs to be a feeder to the pros in, you know, in a couple of years at the outside. Well, I'm, I'm going to tell you up front, you know, our GPA overall from the campus, uh, 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 you know, for all of our uh, sports is a 3.2 overall. That's so, funny. you know, we have 14 out of 17 teams in our department with a 3.0 or better. So academics are going to be a part of this process. Yeah, we're not, you're, we're not going to be able to escape that. Uh, give me right. a heads up to that. All right. We'll have to it's negotiate fine. that. Yeah. Um, so who else is on your schedule <laughs> besides Iowa, Utah, Florida State? Who else are you playing? We also play BYU. We have a home-and-home home series with Brigham Young. Uh, so they come to uh, – we go to their place. They come back the following year. So our non-conference, if you look at our non-conference schedule, it, if it's not the toughest, it's one of the toughest in the country. Oh, yeah. So we have that this year. And then we go into our MAC schedule uh, right after that, which is, again, on the MAC West side, we're always competitive, you know, with the likes of, you know, Toledo, uh, Miami of Ohio. You know, we, we, we have a very competitive schedule this year. There's no question about it. Yeah, he produced a lot of great football players, that names that people know around Chicago, really around the nation, too, a n- number of pros as well. Uh, and it's good to hear uh, the performance of the student athletes at NIU. Both my parents went to NIU. Oh well, damn. So, oh, there you go. Yeah, so so very good. very happy to hear that. And uh, Sean Frazier, uh, good luck on Saturday. Beat Iowa, please, so uh, we can end <laughs> Iowa season early. Sean Frazier, Associate <laughs> Vice President, Director of Athletics at NIU. The game two thirty Saturday on these airwaves, AM five sixty. Sean, thanks for joining us. Have a great season. Yeah, you too. Thank you, thank you, guys. I really appreciate it. Go Hawkeyes. Just kidding. Go Huskies. Um, and also, yeah, we are home of the Huskies. So every game, whether away or home, you can hear right here on AM five sixty. The answer. And Sean joined us on our Turnkey Pro Answer Line. The more you.